this is the future. I mean, it's every science fiction geek's dream, right? Standing. We have a humanoid six foot tall robot walking around. We're, uh, we're working under a grant from the Navy. The robot we've developed for this project, Sapphire, uh, is one of the most advanced robots in the world. And uh, we're very excited to be doing stuff that no one else has done with robots. So we're taking the robot out of the laboratory and actually putting it on a real environment, such as the USS Shadow. The reason why we use this, got on the cut yesterday, John was saying, you know, we, uh, we use this for a clean burn. There's all sorts of challenges that are involved when you take robots out of a laboratory. There's smoke, there's heat. We are by no means done. There is so much more to do to make these something practical that the Navy's really going to be able to use. Don't think it's gonna replace you. It's going to assist you. Every sailor is trained as a firefighter, but that's not their expertise, that's not what they're doing every day. So if you think about the support the Navy provided, for example, in the Haiti earthquake, well, this robot, you'll be able to send it into dangerous situations without having to send a sailor in there first. What we're seeing here is something that's never been done before. We are extinguishing a fire with a robot that is dressed in a tracksuit. So we hope we can keep pushing the technology with the help of ONR and stay at the forefront of robotics research.